I've been seeing some questions lately about embossing text inside of Fusion 360. Um, there is no explicit emboss command currently, but I thought I would show you a way that you can take uh, your text and emboss it. So what I have here is just a simple cylinder with a sketch on the origin plane and the word emboss written. Uh, so what I'm going to do to do this is I'm not going to work, I'm in the model environment, I'm going to work in the patch environment to start out with. So I'm going to switch over to the patch. And under create, I'm going to say that I'd like to create an extrusion. This will create an extrusion as a surface instead of a solid. And so now it's asked me what my profile is. I'll just select that text. And then I can grab my arrow and just pull it through my part. Or I could go to the extents and say I want to go through all. And I'll go ahead and click OK. Now there's the basis of our uh, embossing, but if you look, we still just have a, a face and you can see the edges of the text that we created. So what we're going to do is we're going to split the face of this part. So under modify, I'm going to choose split face and it wants to know what face do I want to split. So I'm going to split this face and then wants to know what my splitting tool is. So for my splitting tool, I'm underneath my bodies folder, I'm going to use those services that I created. So to do this, I can just select the first one, hold the shift button down and select the last one, and that will select all of them. And I'll go ahead and click OK. And now that split the face, you can see that we have a, a change in our face. And now what I can do is just go back and shut off all these bodies because I don't need them anymore. And to finish this, I'm just going to right click and use the press pull functionality. And then we can just start selecting on the different faces. I'll just grab a few of them. Now you put in your, your value that you want to uh, emboss by. It may take a second to think about this. And as it's thinking, um, in a second, you'll get the result that we're looking for. There it is. We can go ahead and click OK. And now there is some embossed text. Here is a different example. On this example, we'll show that uh, we can use the same methodology to split multiple faces at the same time. So I, again, I have some embossed uh, text written here, and I'm going to extrude it through these three surfaces. Um, I'm in the patch environment, so I'm going to go to Create and Extrude select my profile that I want to extrude. So go ahead and click on that and we'll tell it we want to go all the way through again and click OK. And there's the basis of our embossed text. Now I'm going to modify and go split face. Choose the faces that I want to split. And then we're going to select the splitting tools again by selecting these bodies. So hold the shift button down to get them all in one shot. Click OK. Now we can turn the visibility off of all of these bodies. And then I'll right click, choose press pull, and then we can grab the different faces that we would like to emboss. Should also note as I'm doing this, you can either extrude emboss or cut emboss. So I'll just say that I want to extrude this point one and click OK. And there's some embossed text again. Thanks for watching.